if I told you guys I could help you save money and still look fresh at the same time? Well, in this video, we are going to be looking at cheaper alternatives to expensive designer brands. So let's kick this video off with number one, which is Fear of God Essentials. Now, Essentials is technically a cheaper alternative to the inline Fear of God brand, but we're still dealing with $180 for a hoodie, $180 for a jacket, you know, $120 for the shorts and the sweatpants. So the prices still do go up there. Now, Fear of God is uh, synonymous with their earth tones and that baggy and drapier look. But I'm telling you that H&M, believe it or not, has a couple items that mimic the exact details of Fear of God Essentials. Now the products that I'm talking about right now are the hoodies. Now the regular fit hoodies on H&M come in some great earth tone colors. And I actually have two of them right here for you guys. It is the light beige and cream colored hoodie as well as the brown colored hoodie. Now you guys have seen these in previous videos that I've made before. I wear them all the time, which goes to show you that I can absolutely vouch for the quality and the craftsmanship. Now, buying from H&M in store, in my opinion, is one thing, but buying from H&M online is a totally other different beast. It is so much better online, in my opinion, and the reason for that is because they have super fast shipping and easy returns. So you can buy these products and you can ship them out if you don't like it. So what I'll do is I'll leave a link in the description to all the items that I'm talking about in this video. Now, these two hoodies are perfect because you can still achieve that oversized look by sizing up. So if you're a medium and that's how you like to fit your hoodies, just size up to a large and you'll notice that the sleeves are getting longer, the, the actual garment is getting longer uh, towards the waist and everything else like that. Now in terms of the Fear of God sweatpants, I got you guys covered for those as well. These ones from American Apparel that I got from Amazon are a fraction of the price. The quality is still just as good and the style and fit is perfectly there as well. So the Fear of God sweatpants also have that sort of baggier, drapier look, but they have a very specific cuff at the bottom. That's sort of like a retro uh, gym, you know, athleisure type of cuff towards the bottom. Separate from joggers, these ones are just a little bit shorter. And these one from Amazon, once again, feature these a number of times on the video and on the channel, so you know that I, I can speak for them and speak to the quality. These two options are really great and they both come in number of different colors. So even if you don't want the earth tones, you guys got you covered in that one. Okay, so let's talk about some shoes. So the Nike Sakai Waffle has been one of the most popular sneakers of the past few years. They were on everybody's sneaker of the year list about a year, two years ago. Well, Nike has released such a similar shoe to that one for a much more affordable price. And we're talking about the Nike Waffle One. It is almost as if it's a direct copy from the Sakai Waffles, but a fraction of the price and more readily available for you to purchase for you guys to look fresh. So these ones will run you about 110, uh, which is extremely affordable when you're considering that's basically the price of a pair of Nike Air Force Ones. But let me tell you something, these guys mimic the waffle, the Sakai waffle so much when you're talking about that mesh upper and the hits of suede throughout the shoe. It really is such a clean looking shoe. And like I said, much more easier for you guys to get. So when it comes to sneakers, this is definitely one of the best options you're gonna get. And I'm also gonna be talking about another one at the end of the video. So moving on to shorts. It's summertime, we all love wearing shorts. And I find that shorts nowadays have become way more popular, way more hyped for certain brands. And one I'm gonna be talking to you guys today is Eric Emanuel. These shorts are worn by all of the ballers, all of the hoopers, all of the NBA basketball players, athletes, celebrities, you name it, Justin Bieber's of the world, everybody's wearing Eric Emanuel shorts, but they sell out almost instantly and they retail for about like 150 to 120, which is crazy. They've done collaborations with Bape, Trust me, these are the hottest shorts to get at the moment. But I got you guys covered for cheaper alternatives. Umbro makes a checkerboard nylon short that mimics them so much. Now the Umbro shorts that I'm talking about are not the cheap ones that you would wear when you're playing soccer as a kid. These ones are much more stylish, 
to meet the demands of modern fashion. So they come in a number of different colors. They are affordable and you can even purchase some of them on Amazon, which is so, so convenient. You know, you're buying everything else. So why not throw on, you know, a little something extra for you to get fresh. And the best part about these, they have an above the knee fit that fits just like those Erica manual shorts. I was just telling you about, they come in a number of different colors and styles. So when it comes to shorts, these ones for sure are the way to go. So every great outfit has accessories. And the one I'm going to be talking to you about today are hats. Now the most popular hats that you can buy right now, hands down are the hat club exclusive new era fitted caps. They come with side patches. They have a colored under brim and they come in a number of different cool and exciting colors that you don't normally see. Now these hats, certain colorways like the brown colorways sell out for hundreds of dollars on the aftermarket and they're so difficult to get online. Bots are scooping them up, you know it's hopeless. But there are certain alternatives that you can get um, which are the on-field San Diego Padres hat. Those are the ones that come stock, brown. They have the same look and feel. They may not have the colored underbrim, but to be honest, for me, it's not a huge deal. But the way that you can make up for the side patches is you can actually include your own pins or when you go to your local lids or local hat shop, you can actually get uh, uh, designs etched out onto the side of the hat. So the side patches isn't a deal breaker for me personally because there's other ways where you can sort of accessorize and make it look a little bit better. So let's talk about another pair of shoes. Now the Nike Dunks, they're one of the most popular sneakers of the year and each week it is just the same thing where these colorways are releasing, they're swapping out the colors and they sell out instantly. But there's, it's so frustrating and the quality of the shoe isn't even that great in my opinion. But the Nike Blazer Mid 77 is a shoe that has those same details and the same colorways that's much more affordable and much more readily available to get. Now, if you guys have been watching the channel for a while now, you know that I love the Nike Blazer. It's my most watched video, the how to style video for that. So you can check it out by clicking the video right over there. But this shoe is great for so many reasons, right? It has the same yellowed midsole and those sort of vintage details that are so popular on so many different sneakers now. But the only thing is that it's so much easier to get. It's much more affordable and in my opinion, wearing it with jeans, wearing it with shorts is still such a good look. Now, when you think of trends today and you think of people tucking their pants over their sneakers, you think of people wearing short nylon shorts with a graphic tee, you can still achieve that same look but for a more affordable price. And the Nike Blazer, like I said, comes in a number of different colors and it's something that you can buy right now. So what I'll do is I'll leave a link in the description for you guys to shop the Nike Blazer. Now, if you enjoyed this video, click right here to watch summer style trends. This video has over 100,000 views. I guarantee you there's at least one thing that you guys will like there, or you can click this video right here to watch some, or you can click this video right here to learn about 15 different ways to style the Air Jordan 1. Thanks so much for watching and have an amazing day, guys. Peace.